Hey guys, Jonathan here with TLD. Got everything in the mail today to upgrade my quad core MacBook Pro. This is from OWC. This is a 120 gigabyte SSD from OWC and 8 gigabytes of RAM. So we're going to start with that. Also, got something called the Data Doubler. What that's going to allow me to do is take out the optical drive and throw a second hard drive in there. I ordered a uh, 500 gigabyte uh, Black Edition Western Digital hard drive from Amazon. I'll get to that in a second. I'm going to start here. That, let me see here. Memory, tools, and that's about it. There we go. This is the 8 gigabytes of memory. Hopping over to this. I would assume this is a data doubler. No, this is the actual SSD. So 120 gigabyte OWC SSD. About 240 read write speed, so it's going to be blazing fast. Kind of just plowing through this unboxing since there's so much stuff here. And last but not least from OWC is the data doubler. So it has instructions. Uh, like I said, this will allow me to remove the optical drive on the MacBook Pro. This is going to insert there and I can put a uh, 2.5 inch hard drive into that slot so I'll have two uh, dual drives on my MacBook Pro. Last but not least, we got the Amazon order. Let's go ahead and pop this guy open. This is the uh, 500 gigabyte, 7200 RPM Western Digital Black Drive. I think it was like 69 bucks, so it was pretty cheap. Again, I will post that link down below. Now for the memory, the SSD, and the uh, data doubler, I ordered that off OWC. If you actually use Amazon, you can save 10 bucks on the checkout. If you guys want to do that, I'll post that link. And I'll also post the link straight to OWC if you don't want to use Amazon. So I just want to give you guys some options. Here we have it. So this is going to go as a secondary drive. Let's go ahead and bring the uh, OWC drive. This will be the main boot drive. And last but not least, we have the uh, 8 gigabytes of memory. I'm going to upgrade that from 4 to 8. So I hope you guys enjoy this unboxing. Stay tuned for the actual installation uh, and the results of how it performs after that. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to check out the latest video. It's a really cool review on the quad-core MacBook Pro. Put a lot of work into that. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Other than that, if you guys are brand new, feel free to subscribe. And as always, I'll see you guys next time.